Hey guys, it's Sammy Jammy here, and I have a couple of exciting announcements. So a lot of you have been requesting for um, channel memberships and custom videos to um, come back, and excitingly enough, they are both returning. Um, so first, I'm going to go over channel memberships really quickly. I'm going to speed run this. For channel memberships, they're actually open right now, so you can join right now. Um, but there's two tiers. Tier 1 is called the Hats, um, and you're going to have access to all of the channel members videos which is i counted seven seventy five but there might be a few more than that i might have miscounted but there's at least 70 75 um, videos that have never been uh, released publicly on my channel so if you want like a ton of brand new videos then you can join um the hats which is tier one and that costs ten dollars per month and then um the bucket hats is tier 2 which costs $15 per month and you have all the perks of tier 1 so you can see all the old videos um, but also you will have access to an exclusive extra video per month so it's just one that's why it's only $15 but again if you join the channel memberships you're gonna have like literally 70 plus videos um, to scroll through as for custom video requests, um, again, requests are done through Google Forms. This time you don't have to be a channel member in order to request a custom video. However, it's I'm doing it on more of a first come first serve basis. So basically, around the first second week of every month, I'm going to open the Google Form for the first 20 people that submit it. And then I'm going to be picking 5 to 10 videos out of those 20 um, to actually uh, make. Out of those um, 5 to 10 that I select, I will reach out to them via email uh, for payment and any clarifications for the video request. Um, if they don't respond within t 3 days, I will select someone else. Um, each video, each custom video will be 10 to 15 minutes long and costs 40 to $50 depending on the supplies needed. I hate to charge that much for custom videos, but it's a one-woman show here, and a lot goes into setup, getting props together, actually filming, and then editing, so it's a minimum of like three hours production time. Um, so if I'm only making it for one person, then I have to make it worth it for both on both ends, because I don't want to do a bad job and then charge you for it. So obviously I'm open to making exceptions um, so you can always plead your case if you get selected for custom video um, prices are not set in stone so just let me know um, and then finally you will also have the option of receiving your custom video privately um, and in that case I'll email you an unlisted link or you can allow me to post your video publicly so that everyone can enjoy it um, obviously either one is fine I'm not going to charge you differently depending on which um, just if you allow me to post it publicly, it's a little bit more helpful, but again, you paid for the video, so it's your decision. Um, yeah, other than that, you guys can comment any questions, comments, concerns you have, um, and I will dig through them and I'll answer you guys. Um, but yeah, thanks for listening, and let's get on with the video. I knew I shouldn't have come into work today. Do you want a piece of gum? Well, it's watermelon, if you really need to know what kind it is. You're allergic to the pink dye? You can't say I didn't try. I tried to start off on a good foot, on a good note. 
You're allergic to this. Okay. I didn't really want to give you a piece anyways, I was just trying to be nice. But clearly, like, you could have just taken it. I'm literally checking you in. You don't need to be rude. Yeah, I don't need- I know your name at this point. You still don't know mine because it's Cassandra and you keep calling me Cassandra. You know what? Let's just not go by names, okay? We can have a perfectly normal interaction without saying each other's names. Okay, you're here for a lies check? Yeah, it's probably long overdue. If you've been balding since you were 10 years old, one would think that you would have gotten that checked out already, but... You're not balding? No, like, receding hairline? Oh, so your forehead's just like that? Okay. Okay, um, in the past 14 days, have you come into contact with anyone who had lice? No? Then why are you here? Because you're going back to school, okay. Okay. I'm gonna put on some gloves. Take your temperature. My hair is everywhere. Let me take your temperature to make sure that you don't have COVID. You probably would, would like bring it in here on purpose. So open your mouth. Okay, close. I'm gonna let this slide just because I want to get paid, but technically, I should be sending you home. What was it? 98.9? That's technically a fever. Okay, now... I need to do a face inspection, okay? There's... Listen, I'm gonna... If I, if I vomit... After looking at your face for too long... I apologize ahead of time. Yeah. But also, I'm not really... I mean, if I do have to throw up, I... You kind of deserve it, so... I'm looking for, like, any signs of lice. I don't really know what that means, but it just says that on the instructions. No, this is my first day here. Um, I got released from my other job. I basically quit. Why would I tell you why? It's none of your business. Just 
just so you know you moving around so much is not making this process any easier or faster so <sighs> look that way more 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 Okay, the other way. Not so far, God. Okay, look down. I'm doing a quick scan of your scalp with the light before I go in there. And again, I can't tell if this is like lice or like really bad dandruff or maybe it's both <sighs> okay look up I'm not really sure why I need to check under your chin but it's part of the rules so yeah we're done okay No, um, evidence of bugs thus far. Okay, I'm going to now start the physical scalp examination. Okay, if you could tilt your head down. More. 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 Thank you. If you actually brushed your hair once in a while, then this process would probably be easier. But you look like you've lived a life equivalent to Tarzan. Literally, like, so. tangled and greasy. Like, I literally can't. I'm not even focusing on checking for lice right now. I'm literally just, like, trying to detangle your hair. You didn't ask me to? Okay, well, how do you expect me to do my job? Like, why would you come to a lice check clinic without brushing your hair? You did brush it? With what? Your fingers?
I'm gonna actually look for bugs in here, I guess. Although, to be quite frank, I wouldn't be surprised if you had an entire ecosystem living in here. Yeah, that's how dirty it is. You've like slowly looked back up and I need you to stay looking down. I'm not looking at your face. I'm looking at your the top of your head. Well, I didn't see anything, but I'm still going to pluck out a few of your, like, ingrown hairs up here, just because they're bothering me. And to be honest, you probably do have lice, I just didn't really look correctly. I'm not really qualified for this job, I kind of lied on my resume, so... I said, I think I forgot to clean this off after I used them on the last patient. You probably deserve lice anyway, so... I'm gonna do one final check just because you really seem like the kind of person who would have lice what's that supposed to mean? I don't just take it you just forget it I'm gonna give- what did you say you needed it for? School, right? Yeah, I'm not really gonna give you a report or anything because I didn't do the best of jobs looking for your lies. Um, if you want a report, then you should probably go somewhere that is actually qualified. You don't need to raise your voice at me. Sorry I wasted your time. Okay, well you can leave then. 